Now let's talk about the trucker's hitch. Now it's really hard for me to show you the trucker's hitch here because it's really nice to crank things down while I'm doing it. So I'm gonna take you back a couple of years. It's a good application, so I'm just gonna show it to you here. All right, now the trucker's hitch comes in handy when you wanna take something, say like on top of your car, and you wanna tighten it down quite a lot. This kayak works really good for demonstration purposes. So I've basically got this kayak on here, and this is the last bit that I wanna tie down. Now, one way that a lot of people will just tie down a kayak is they'll just, you know, wrap, wrap the rope around and they'll try to like tie some hitches or something in the, in the rope. But the problem is that then it's still not super tight. That's why you tie a trucker's hitch. So to do that, you need to tie a little knot up in the top. And I like to tie a slip knot, which is the best way I think to tie a trucker's hitch. Basically you take the rope, twist it like so, and then come back up through with a little bit of rope, kind of tighten that thing down just a little bit. So you have that loop, which is easily pulled out if you want, right? And then you're gonna take the leading edge through your uh, hook on the car, put it back through that hole, and then you can just crank that puppy all the way down. That's pretty good, tight enough for my kayak to stay on. Now I'm gonna finish that off with two little half hitches here. Keeps that tight. And then one more, make sure it stays on. There you go, that's your trucker's hitch. I use that knot all the time. One of my top three knots. All right, stay tuned for the next video.